could possibly go wrong? Let's mm. go to our team coverage now. Crown Force Sarah Stinson, I think having a morning so that she could actually bring you a personal experience about how <laughs> difficult it is to get around in the rain. Do tell, Sarah, what's oh. up? How did you wind up where you are at the Bay Bridge? <laughs> Well, I haven't driven through this intense of rain since my first year at Cron, so three years. And, you know, it's dark outside driving, and you can see how intense it is out here. And there's at least a foot of flooding on the roadway as you head to the Bay Bridge. Drove through it as slow as I could. I saw other people doing the same. I don't know how their car's doing, but my car is not sounding good. So if our engineers are listening to this, they're probably mad at me right now. But I did everything I could. Could and the, my I drove through my car's making really bad sounds and uh, I'm worried about some water in my engine. So take it slow out there. Uh, this is just a story, just to, as you head out the door to remind you to go slow because the roadways are flooding. It was almost to the point where I was like, should they close this roadway? I, I feel like they should um, because it's, it's dark out there. It was an overpass as well. Now out here, it's also very slick and. Uh, as you can see out here, people aren't going as slow as they probably should, especially as they're approaching the toll plaza. It's important that you slow it down. What is the rush? I mean, is it worth it? I don't think so. Uh, and I think a lot of people forget how quickly something can change with slick roads. You make one bad decision, you could end up spinning out, you could end up hydroplaning, hitting someone, and honestly, not to be dramatic, but die. You could die out here if you're not careful. So be careful as you head out there on the road. This is intense rain. I didn't have my rain pants on because they were in the car, so I ran to my car, uh, and within those 10 seconds, my leggings were soaked, my, my socks were soaked, and, and now look at me, I'm wearing a jacket, rain pants, got the rain boots. We're all set up. I hope it, uh, so far I feel pretty dry, but I hope it uh, keeps me dry all morning long. We'll be out here showing you all of the East Bay. Not sure if I'm gonna leave my car here and yeah. hop in the uh, live truck. Oh, but, uh, wow. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of scary. <laughs> Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> My God, uh, this is amazing, Sarah. I mean, this is the best, most informative report, uh, yeah. frankly, that I've ever heard uh, of a reporter hand. in the race. Look. So, so you actually think that the, the <clears throat> that area you drove through should be marked because it was that deep? And and tell me more about how the car reacted and what, what you think is going to happen with the car now. You don't think it, it'll drive? I, I sure hope so, but it just sounds really bad. Yeah. It sounds like there's water in there that it's struggling. It almost sounded like I had a flat tire, that like scraping sound. Yeah. And, wow. Um, okay. And it was right as you're getting on to the freeway from Market Street in San Francisco, uh, and it's that straightaway as you head on, you either go south or you right. go north, um, and or you rather you go east or you or go west. south. Yeah. And, um, yeah, it's intense, you guys. I mean, it, it, it's very, very deep, and yeah. it, sometimes you can't see it as well. I knew that area was flooded because it's always flooded, but I have seen this intensive rain. I'm, I honestly think since three years ago when I first started at Cron. Yeah. Interesting. I mean, this, this is like... It's, it's just uh, nonstop. Yeah. Intense. Well, and every now and then we'll see a car go by oh. and send up a huge wave of water over the barrier there. So, yeah, be careful. Yeah. Uh, yeah, be careful out there. All of the cars by me earlier just had waves all yeah. on the side. We wow. all were just like... Mm -hmm. And when you're on the Bay Bridge, take it slow. There's a lot of wind on the upper deck. And so you're not only dealing with this intense rain, I mean, you can see the wind yeah. right now yeah. as I'm talking to you, but heavy, heavy wind on that upper deck. Um, but what did you say, Oli? Oh, yeah, the trees. Yeah, you can see right there. We're going to show you some of the wind out here, the, yeah. the trees, yeah. the palm yeah. trees. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, look at that wind, you guys. I mean, hold on to that wheel with all your might and, yeah. and make sure, you know, you're making the right decision. Don't break abruptly if you do hit flooding. Take it easy. Yeah. Breathe. We got this, guys. Yeah. I mean, I know it sounds a little dramatic. You, if you're from here, you know this is a lot. Okay? Yeah. This is yeah. a lot. Absolutely. Yeah. I, no, and you you did all of the right things, and I'm glad you're okay, but great warnings, and, I mean, it all worked out for you. And look, you're well live before. We thank you so much, Sarah. All right, we're going to give you a minute to uh, contain, yeah, we'll, we'll gather yourself. You
Okay. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> so, back, and again, learn from Sarah's experience. Give yourself a lot of following distance with the car in front of you yep. because.